Let's see how many grenade launchers. One. Oh, I'm here and moving the vehicle. Let's scope this out for a sec. Where's the young subjective here? Should we check it out? Let's, let's give it a look for a sec. Actual tool marked you as a high value target your location is compromised what was that i know i'm up here Dead. Holy shit. How do we get up here? I'm not gonna have that, that's way too risky. Fucking hell, dude. Don't think you guys have. Now. Oh, he's up here. Holy shit. <sighs> One HP. Damn near. My heart is racing right now. That was insane. Yo, so kind of random. We're actually rebranding to tag. This is just cleaner and makes more sense to me. Hope y'all don't mind. Anyways, enjoy. Oh shit, here we go. Masra. Explore, secure intel, and loot to gain access to All new right. Missions. Enemy threat is high, so expect contact. DMZ is here, and so am I. It's been a while. We got a challenge on our hands, a very difficult one. So, you can see, I don't have a loadout. I have absolutely nothing. And what's our challenge? Well... Got this little toxic zone here, which has the chemist boss who drops a custom M13. We're gonna go ahead and try to pick that up. Then head our way over here to the next boss who has a juggernaut uh, weapon case drop. He is a juggernaut with a minigun and he drops our weapon case, which we need. And then with those two items, we will extract or attempt to against trio teams. We have a nice little orange box to start off with. Oh, and an M13. Things are already looking up. So we have 24 minutes to do this. And it's not going to be easy. I've been at this for about two days with no success yet. We've gotten close. We've gotten close, but no success. So let's fly our way to a vehicle and get on with it. Not a bad gun either, but I think we're good with our M13. I'm calling this M13. It's M4, EBR14. That's what I meant. Ultra One, activity is increasing near your location. Stay alert. All right. So once we do pick up this weapon case, we are marked for every enemy, like through walls. It's pretty terrible, honestly. Um, so we're gonna want to extract. Get out of here as fast as possible as soon as we pick that up. So that's why we're doing it last. And we're off. So we'll head towards our chemist here, and he's in a toxic zone. We're going to need a gas mask for it, and we can find those off of bodies within the zone. Vehicle AI, I believe, behind us. It's fine. Excuse me, coming through. And there we can see our toxic cloud. The 
chemist should be around this marker. Completing contracts earns you cash to buy gear and upgrades. So we're just gonna send it straight in here. See if I can get a kill real quick. Ultra one, the chemist is approaching your area. Stay alert. No. So we gotta find an AI within range who can drop us a gas mask. I'm thinking up here maybe we can find somebody. There's a squad of guards. Let's make a run for it. We have one stem to keep us alive and I need to get a kill fast here. There's our stem off. Absolute mad lad, we did it. Now we can take our time a bit more. It's actually helpful, thank you. was in there, probably nothing good. Things moving quick. Chemist should be close here. There he is. Ultra one, we're seeing increased activity in the area. Stay sharp. Oh, that hurt. Oh no, are we dead? We're dead. We're dead. We're dead. We're dead. Okay. Somehow. I'm gonna make a sprint for it. Terrible idea, terrible idea. I don't know what I'm gonna do. We need to get over there though somehow. Oh! Mission complete. He came to us. We got the gun, we're out of here. Oh shit. Not like this, not like this. Look at my HP. Unreal. That's actually unreal. Do I have a guy looking at me? Please just hurry up and heal. Wow. The gods are watching over us today. Catch my breath for a sec. What do we got? This is actually a good key, I think. It's gold. That's a good sign. Alright, next we have to head here and look for our juggernaut. And we'll, we'll take this extract most likely, although this is a decent one too. I like that one too because it's away from everything. But well, we're just gonna head to this one I think on our left. But first we gotta kill the juggernaut, let's go! You know, I see a boat here, we're actually gonna players. Let's go take a peek at this guy. One grenade launcher. How would that not hit them? What the fuck? Come on. He's trying to res. One HP, we're gonna push off that. The knock goes out, we gotta duo down. 
Sorry, buddy. Man, they didn't drop. Oh, uh, we don't want that. They didn't really drop me much, did they? Okay. Well, that worked out. We're here now in the juggernaut area. We're gonna swim ourselves over to the main island and try to locate him. Okay, actually, he just died. We got another team to deal with. So, that weapon case would be the weapon case he just dropped. I can see the players right now. I'm not sure if AI or a player just shot at me. Probably AI. We're completely out of armor. Which is really bad. So we just knocked a player. This guy's swimming. Hello? Players are down. Let's get in here quick while we can. I don't know what that last guy was doing. It's glitched. I'm going in. That might have been a player that just full autoed me. I think the weapon case may be glitched. It's not great. It's not great at all. That's who shot me, I believe. Gotta be really careful without armor here. Three plates. Now, what is going on here? This cannot be real. Please, God, let me have this case. You can't do this to me. What? Okay, so this is bullshit. Instead of grabbing the weapon case, let's go ahead and activate. Oh, it looks like someone else might have just activated this UAV tower. So let's go ahead and kill. Another team, and then we'll get ourselves out of here, and we'll call it a day. So that is just not fair. So while we're here. Um, I'll give my thoughts on DMZ just a little bit as an Escape from Tarkov player, as this is a spin-off from the game mode that was pretty much invented by Escape from Tarkov, which is just a leader extraction shooter, so... DMZ, it's a lot of fun, people are loving it, it's a good time, the AI is challenging but fairly balanced, um, they're not the aimbots you'll find in Tarkov, not as much so at least. Um, it's great for friends, it's great for learning the maps, leveling up, co-op missions are great, um, it's not without its problems though, and the main thing just being lack of content and progression, oh okay, yeah, we got a team on the top here, they're probably gonna know I'm here, that's fine, but yeah, it's, it's just lacking progression, there's no traders, there's not, not much of an inventory or hideout outside of the game, you can't quite upgrade guns or gear, um, I just, the longevity of it isn't quite set up to be there yet. This is a good angle. One knocked. They 
Stimmt, ah. I have no armor, this is gonna be tough. Where did they just go? Oh. Oh, holy shit. One HP in a dream. Surely they don't have much armor left. Get over that. Holy shit. Where's your buddy? Oh, got two down. Looks like a squad wipe to me. No, I don't need any of this stuff, do I? Take some armor. Anyways, as I was saying, yeah, I would like the game to just have more risk versus reward, more of a economy and high tier like valuable things you can bring in that you really wouldn't want to lose but it currently has a great foundation and it could could become something huge so we'll see we'll see what happens um warzone itself which i'll probably be making some videos on soon hopefully i think it's great i, I love most of the changes i know a lot of people aren't a fan of the way they've slowed down the gameplay and lower ttk and some people are saying campers have been given an advantage uh, and I just don't fully agree with that. I really like the, the more hardcore feel and the less running gun spamming UAVs, uh, which got really repetitive. That sort of UAV gameplay where people are just doing the same thing every game, which is just hunting without much tactics in mind. They're just, if you have a good four man, you can kind of just roll through every team you encounter without a carry in the world, which got really lame, I think. And we've reached our exfil, so let's try to hold it down. I think I'm going to take this building, actually. Imagine we die here. But yeah, overall, I'm a huge fan of the changes. Um, it's not a perfect game by any means, and I'm excited to see where they take things. But current Warzone 2 is feeling very fresh. It doesn't feel like a, a reskin. The map, I think, is pretty sweet. I do like it. And with that... Oh, with that, we're gonna get blown up. I'm gonna call that a challenge complete, boys. Got our M13. We, uh... <laughs> We want to talk about the weapon case, okay. I'm not doing this anymore. This, I've been honestly doing this challenge for two days. I think I'm good. I'm, I'm just gonna dip. Call it a day. But yeah, I don't think I'll be coming back to DMZ much until we see more content. I just wanted to make one video on it. Show, uh, show it off a little bit. Give you a few of my thoughts, which I've done. And that'll be all. I appreciate y'all for watching.